All right, we're checking out a crazy video. Um, it's just called "To Catch a Kick Predator." Now it's fairly long, but we're gonna watch this from front to back. Um, and we're gonna see what's going on with this. We're gonna check this out. Let's look at it. This is Riot LOL. Omar is his real name. He's a 20-year-old kick streamer, TikToker, Twitter slash X user, whatever you want to call it. And here's him about to get a girl that's clearly, let's say, not of age to expose herself live on his stream. What? But before we get there, let me tell you about a website called Kick. Kick is a live streaming competitor to Twitch, started by these three dudes, one of them being a live streamer named Trainrex, who left Twitch to start Kick because of their inconsistent policies. Now, Kick is fairly new and more lenient on what you can and can't do on there. That's why some of the most controversial figures have made Kick their new home, giving Kick this persona of being the place for the troublemakers, the rebels, the place for free speech where anyone can say anything and anything can happen. Hey, even people in my field, some Omi TV and Omegle creators have also moved over to Kick. Also, Omi TV is an Omegle alternative that everyone's been using since the original Omegle shutdown. But for the sake of this video, I'm just gonna call it Omegle because it's basically Omegle 2.0. But let me paint okay. you a picture. Creators on YouTube that live stream Omegle content have to cover the screen because it's always unpredictable what you're gonna see on there. Not gonna lie, some of the things you see on Amigo could get your channel terminated just like and say yeah. That's why I think that's why Twitch doesn't allow it. They don't allow like uh like monkey app, Omegle, things like that. Okay, that makes it sense. gives you a little bit of a perspective on how Kick operates. Alright, now let's talk about Riot LOL. When you first enter Riot in a bunch of these Kick creators' live streams, you get a warning saying you must be 18 or older to view this content. Keep it Mine isn't. Mine isn't. I don't have that on. You can turn it on, but you can turn it on for a lot of things. But that's valid. Okay. Get in the back of your mind going forward for the rest of this video. Fair warning, this is going to get very serious very quickly. And I definitely understand if you want to sit this one out. But here we go. Riot live streams for three to seven hours every single night sometimes even longer. His content consists of just trying to find girls on Omegle. Like it's literally the main focus of his content for hours on end. And after going through dozens of his VODs, you start to notice a pattern. Hey. Now, hello, my name's Omar, uh, nice to meet you. Um, Hi, Omar. Nice to meet you, tits. Where are you from, tits? Hello, tits. Oh my, tits. Hello, tits. My name's Omar, nice to meet you, tits. Where are you from, tits? All right, let me tell you uh, where I'll take you on a date. Let me know if it hits. All right, uh, I'll pick you up. I'll pick you up. I'll pick you up. So I'll pick you up, and then we'll get some, we'll get some sushi. Uh, we get some sushi. We get sushi. We'll get sushi. All right, and then I don't, I don't really fuck with like boring dates. You know what I'm saying? They gotta be like fun, right? Not awkward, not corny. I don't like the boring dates, you know, where it just feels like unorganic and it's just like cringy and awkward. So I like to do something to break the ice. Oh, probably like a carnival. Carnival. A carnival. A carnival. Okay. So like play some games, ride some rides. You ride me. And then, um, and then, like, I'll win you a cute bear. He tries to, quote-unquote, riz up these girls by saying the same lines over and over again, just so that he can eventually get their Snapchats, so that he can build up his Snapchat roster. Dude, my roster is actually nice. No, 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 no. And that's it. That's his content. Is what? That's kind of, that's corny as hell. That is so fucking corny. Like, oh. Okay, that's corny as hell. Talk to me. I, I'm trying to go into this with an open mind, but you can already see, like you can already see on my face. It's like that shit's cringy as fuck. What I thought until I saw this interaction. He started the conversation off by doing the same old shtick. The more they talked, the more the girl was opening up to him, telling him about a toxic and abusive ex she had. I'm gonna spare you the details. And let me remind you, she has no idea that she's saying this in front of a live stream full of hundreds of people. That's also what's fucked up to me. So it's like, um, like, okay, I get Omegle, and you know what I'm saying? It's for content, also at the same time. Sometimes they know the person, sometimes they don't. But like, I feel like if they get to saying too much, like, tell them they're on a live stream. Or even when you first get in there, be like, yo, I'm live streaming this, da 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 you know what I'm saying? If you want to be, you know, other people are seeing this. I don't, I just don't understand why you wouldn't tell somebody that they're being live streamed. Especially if they're about to open up about something like that. Please just tell people they're on the live. Some people and... don't volunteer, don't want to be, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes, sometimes they want to talk to a person one-on-one. -on -one. Sometimes they don't want to be in front of hundreds or even thousands, you know? 
the worst part is that she seemed very out of it. She was slurring her words, jumping from one conversation to the next, pausing in the middle of talking just to examine the room while blinking. So that's what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. Wow. Anyway. Wait, what did you say? Oh, nothing. And after that, she told Riot that she was drugged by someone at a concert that night. Can I tell you something? I was uh, at a festival, but no, I, not at a festival, but at a, at a concert. You know, Foo Fighters? They, they came in my, in where I live right now. This guy, he came to me and he gave me this kind of cake. He, he said like, hey, take these, you're gonna feel so good. So I ate them with my friends, but I ate one completely. There was weed in this f***ing sh uh. I still feel f***ed up. And really, yeah, whatever. But the entire time she was saying all that, Riot was constantly looking at the kick chat. And all they were saying was, Z, 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 Z. She's yapping like crazy. She's hot, but talks too much. Omar doesn't even seem amused. And after seeing all of those comments, it sparks Riot to say this. All right, dude, listen, I'm not gonna lie. I can't do this anymore, bro. The curiosity is just and like it's like spinning in the back of my head it's killing me like dude listen let's let's go fit check come on spit check i'm like i'm not gonna lie that's like enough talking bro i'm like uh i'm like about to fall asleep yeah let's go i don't want to get too wait it's like getting so hot in my room yeah, hold on. so uh you know i'm shirtless your shirt is on this is a really tough situation you know read the fucking room okay read the like Read the room, bro. Read the room. Like, even if I'm doing this, you know what I'm saying? She ate the cake, whatever. She knows that, you know, it had weed in it. Whatever the case may be. If she's telling you about it. And, like, say I really don't care. If you don't care or anything, just next it, bro. Next the person. Just next, like, you're... I, yo, you can't like this is this is actually stupid to me. Wait, huh? Like, go to the next person. If if your chat is not fucking with it, you know what I'm saying? She's talking too much. Any, just go to the next person, bro. You're trying to make you you're so hell bent on making content out of this. You're not reading the fucking room. You feel me? Like you you're it's like. Just be a decent fucking person for a second. Like, oh. Like, tell her, report that shit to the police, go on to the next person. You know what I'm saying? There's not much you can do. And I get that. There's not much you can do. Your chat don't want to listen to her talk about what she's talking about. Okay, cool, that's fine. Go to the next person, bro. It's just like you're really trying your damnedest to make content out of this, and that's corny as hell. He proceeds to cover the screen. She get on the same page here. You know, can I see your <laughs> like? <laughs> Why am I doing that? Because I'm fucking high that I'm doing that, but it's so fucking embarrassing. Like, uh, set it up. I'm so what? Let me see. Damn. Holy. <laughs> shit. I mean, you said you had a fat ass, right? I mean, like at this point, can I like, you know? Can I see it? And then the audio goes silent for a few minutes, and then he comes back and does this. I'm on the beat. Bang! I'm the GOAT! Join the Discord, boys. I wish there was a way I could, like, cut out my version, because, like, I'm not gonna lie, chat. Oh, God, I was about to risk it all. I, I get done around here, boys. Is that fire? I'm not gonna lie, that was the baddest girl I've ever bagged. What you just witnessed is the main reason why I'm making this video. He goes on Omegle just to get girls to expose themselves so that he can secretly screen record it and post it onto a Discord server under an NS. That is it. so not only like that is so fucking corny. That is, oh my god, wow. So you're you're screen recording these girls, asking them to expose themselves behind a paywall. What? It's behind. So you're making. Okay, I I can't. I literally can't. 
keep stopping and talking about this. This is long as fuck. But... Sub W channel. That is his content. And it's all done live on kick. And the worst part is that was an example of a girl that's of age. Here's one that's not. Overall team, and I didn't spend a single pay. Oh my. Oh my god, my tooth's like out. What the hell? Yeah, like, I mean, like, why are they not more out is a real question. I mean, like, what time is it? You know, it's already demon hours. Kid. Wait, listen, how old are you? I'm 19. Oh, I'm 16. <laughs> you said 18? Yeah. No more needs to be said. Like, I. After this seven minute mark right here, nothing else needs to be said. Nothing else needs. To, I don't even need to see any more evidence. You're one of those weirdo ass niggas. And that, that's. I, I, I actually hate it. I really do hate it because, like, there are people on this platform trying to grow and trying to do good things and trying to build a community over here. And it's just, this. it doesn't, like, now, mind you, don't get me wrong. There's predators on every fucking site. There is. They're just, uh, they're on TikTok. They're on YouTube. They're on fucking, uh, you know, TikTok, YouTube, Twitch, whatever the fuck. You know what I'm saying? But as a growing platform and it being allowed to, like, when somebody's doing stuff like this and they, like, come on, bro. They, they, you gotta, I need kick to get their rules together or something, bro. Even if, like, your main content is talking to people on Omegle. Okay, cool. But then what you're doing after that is insane. You're re you're recording it, getting them to expose themselves. That is insane. Putting it behind a paywall to, to people. Sh like, bro, that is insane. Talking to underage people in that kind of way is insane. So, like, niggas should be free to do Omegle, but if you're going to use it in this weird ass, just get the fuck off the app, bro. Because there's people on here with, like, genuine communities genuinely want to see this platform grow. Generally, actually like the platform and the people that run it and shit like that. But it, it's just, it's, like, hard to keep your name attached to something if you see something like this, bro. Yeah. He has this little trick that he likes to do. It's kind of a manipulation tactic where he goes, like, you're 18, right? As if it's going to magically turn this kid into an adult. But, uh, last time I checked, that's just not how that works. You said 18? Yeah, yeah. You're 18, yeah? Yeah. Oh, cool. All right. So, um, I don't see an issue here. And just like before, he proceeds to cover the screen. It's like, uh, you know, it's kind of like, I don't know. It looks really hot in your room. Like, you need to like, oh. like take anything off or like, uh, damn. Holy. Yeah. Wait, can you like, can you like shake him a little bit? Damn. Dude, out of my Snapchat. I'm not going to lie. Holy f you're bad. All right. Okay. You out of my Snapchat. Please tell me you out of me, my Snapchat. I'm going to right after all right, me. All right, all right, all right. All right, bro, peace. Good night. And when he comes back... Oh, my God. <laughs> Chat, you said she was 18. What are y'all on for? Nah, Chat, I'm not going to lie. That was a fucking dub. I got, like, two clips of them. Bro, like, she just, like, took off her shirt. We were just vibing. Like, ha, ha. Like, I didn't even know. Nah, that was crazy, Chat. Holy f That's, like, I'm not even trying... The thing is, your chat even said to you, bro... She's 16. She's underage. Chad, she says she was 18. What are y'all tripping about? Lock the... F like, you... There's... Yo, there's no way you're like... Who the fuck is this horny, bro? This horny. This dumb. This... What the fuck kind of content even is this, bro? This is the corniest shit I've ever seen in my life. Showing the best dub I've gotten yet. All right, chat, it's in there. It's in there. Join the Discord. Let me know if they're W fire or mid. Or chat, they were nice, right? Go look at the Discord. We just got a huge dub. I could have brought that. I, honestly, dude, chat. If I wasn't streaming, I could have got that to do everything. Chat, like, dude, everything, bro. There's no care, no remorse. To him, it's just content. When in reality, what he just did. That's first of all. It what he just did is very much illegal. 
He recorded it when she said she was 16. Put it out to the masses on Discord. Nigga, that's, that's, that's CP. It's literally CP, bro. And it's without her consent. Exactly. Is, and I'm not going to sugarcoat it, possession and distribution of CP. All done live on kick. And to all the weirdos out there that are like, well, the age of consent is actually 16. Um, I got two answers for you. Riot, who is based in Miami, as he publicly states on his profiles and also on his streams, the age of consent there is 18. And regardless of the Romeo and Juliet laws, where in some states 16 is the age of consent, 18 is the age for pornographic material in all states. So any age under 18 is CP. And it doesn't matter if the girl takes them and sends them. It is still CP. Exactly. Like, chat, there's niggas that, there's, there's people that are getting fucking, they're going to jail or they're getting like misdemeanors or felonies. For sending out flicks of themselves because they're underage. You don't think they're going to do it? You don't think they're going to do that shit to you? Niggas get charged for sending out pictures of themselves. Of themselves. They took willingly. Like, use your fucking brain, bro. And two, if you really want to be on that age of consent is 16 thing, uh, well, just roll the clip. I like your glasses. I mean, they're fake as but they look good on you. Are you near started or far sided? Far. Okay. Um, That's good then. So like when we're up close, like you went in for a kiss, like you want like headbutt me or some dumb shit, you know? Right, you're actually really pretty though. You're like wife material. I'll take you on a date, you know? Not gonna lie. All right, rate that date one through 10. It's 10? Wait, how old are you? Oh my God. You're gonna skip if I tell you my- I mean like you're 18, right? <laughs> Wait, say your age. You're gonna skip though. Would you say your age? Okay, so I'm gonna. <laughs> Yo. All right. Okay. Um. Hey, cops. I promise. Like, I swear, age is just a number. I'm gonna ask you again. Okay. I'm 19. How old are you? 18. You're. Oh my God. All right, bro. Like I. 18. Nod your head if you're 18. Uh, All right. Uh. You know, all right, can I get like a fit check? All right, I'm not gonna lie, dude. Like, I'm a really transparent guy. I just kind of like skip all the bullshit, you know, because it's like, like, are you, are you dumb, bro? Nah, it's just like a waste of time. To be honest, can you just like, okay, when you stood up, I was really only looking at one thing, to be honest. Uh, can you just like show me? It's you're just, you just gotta be, you just gotta be the dumbest fuck ever. You got this, like, there's just no way. How do you proceed to hear someone say they're underage? Tell them to say that they're at the age and then still proceed to ask them to do some shit. Like, you know they're still underage. Oh, my God. It's awesome show I know it sounds crazy, but if you think about it, this could lead into something great, you know? I'm not on here. I don't do that. Word. Damn. All right, then. Well, I mean, like, wait, why not? Not, like, right away. All right, well, let's, let's just wait a second. All right, so, you know, it's been, like, not right away, and the curiosity's just killing. All right, dude. This is what I, like, can I just hear this, bro? Like, real shit. Yeah, thank you for cool. All right. Just wanna see that. Chad, that's 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 the I do for you guys, bro. This man pressured a 15 year old to flash for them, his viewers, that for some reason want to see that. Also, we have no idea how old Riot's viewers are behind the screen, so they could be a bunch of toddlers or a bunch of grown adult men, which is concerning in so many ways but i'm getting ahead of myself riot streams for hundreds of people every single night who let's be honest are only there for one thing and one thing only the girls not the creator the girls if you remove the aspect of girls from more than half of these kit creators they would have no content they would not know what to do 
therefore their views would go down. Besides being an absolute annoyance in society and doing or saying the most contra- This yo, this nigga, the other nigga, I don't, what the fuck was that nigga's name on, 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 uh, or that, I just, I seen his shit pop up. There was another nigga on Twitter. I seen, I seen Dexter O posting it. Like, and then he got the audacity to come on there and apologize, like, Oh, I don't, I don't treat women that way. You know, um, no, not him, not him. I'm not talking about Jack. There was another dude. He was like, I don't treat women that way. I have a mother and a sister. And I'm like, nigga, you already said what you said. Trying to be edgy, trying to make fucking content. There's nothing funny about that shit, bro. There's nothing funny about it. I don't give a, I don't give a damn. Controversial things just to get their five seconds of fame on Twitter for the day. If they're not doing any of that, well, there better be a girl on the screen because then these talentless creators would have nothing. Now, it's one thing to work with these creators, which I don't know why you would do that to each their own, but it's one he made it social subscriber too. Of course, the niggas, this shit has 163,000 views. Posted on a channel that got a million, uh, 3,000 3, comments. Also, the channel that got almost two million. Yeah, he's cooked. The thing to work with these creators by collabing or doing these e date streams that a lot of them love to do. But it's another thing to not even know that the explicit stuff that you did for someone was being live streamed, secretly screen recorded, and posted elsewhere on the internet. And I would add an additional level of fear if you are a child having all this happen to you. What I've shown you are three examples from Riot Stream. Each interaction only lasting around five to 15 minutes. He streams for three to seven hours a night. Wow. And he's been doing this for five plus months now. So it's safe to say that there's multiple girls. Actually, no, I'm gonna say it. Multiple victims that right now don't know. They don't know that they were on his streams. Riot has lots of connections and knows a lot of kick streamers. Slowly trying to grow his audience bigger and bigger on kick's platform. He's even started to get recognized on Omegle. Wait, 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 wait. You know me? You watch my streams? And what strikes me about kick streamers is their sense of humor. When I meet girls in person, I get nervous and how do I get better? You gotta just push yourself. You gotta like, be like, oh sh now it's time. To if it gets really bad, just get the rupees. No, you, what the f I thought that's where what? you're going with that. Did we get married? Uh, I'm gonna thank you. Don't I make me use the rupees, please. Like, I, I ran out of them. Like, let's just make- just, Like, bro, all right, bro. All right, bro. Like, that's not even funny. And the thing is, chat, you joke, you joke about certain shit with the homies that you can't really joke about. But, like, these are, are unwilling participants in your fucking wannabe edgy jokes, bro. I'll joke with the homies. I'll probably some, sometimes say some shit out of pocket. Never to this extent. But we've all said some out of pocket shit to the homies in, a, in, in attempts to be funny. But, like, this is never, like, never a factor. And even being edgy, even with your friends, this isn't like this isn't a joke, bro. This isn't a joke. Make this easy, okay? Since I'm like famous, on friends, would you like to hop on? You know, we make a cool little movie. Yeah, absolutely not. I That's just ran out of rupees, okay? Like, let's just make this nice and easy. Where the fuck is my sleepover invite? She burned it. It's okay. I was gonna slip in while you're sleeping. Either way, hold on. <laughs> I accidentally. You nah, I'm tweaking, bro. You think I actually? Yeah, you're. Yeah, you're cooked. Bro. I can't even. I can't. I don't even want to keep talking and really discuss. But like, you just gotta be the scum of the earth, bro. You beat one. <laughs> That's fucking weird. Like to make a joke about like someone beating women. Like not the one. That's weird. Stop being soft, bro. It's a f joke. I'm not soft. All I'm saying is it's a little weird. I mean. Yeah. No. All dark humor is weird, but that's the funny in it. So what was I supposed to say? Beating a woman doesn't really, like... No, I'm saying we were f***ing with you. We played some class f***ery on you. It was funny, because we were sitting on a call. He saw me talking to you, because I was screen sharing. So I was like, dude, just f*** with her. Like, and then, yeah. Mm -hmm. But then, 
I don't know. He labels this as dark humor. Where's the joke? It's especially concerning when you are actively trying to build a community as an influencer. And this is how you influence your audience. If you guys want, honestly, the script that will work a thousand times out of ten, it will never fail. No matter on the girl, the situation, no anything. This textbook Riz, it works every time. You grab a little, um, I'm not gonna say it. You curry that sh into a cup and you just give it to her, you know? And then... Okay, bro. From there, it's cake. I'm kidding. Holy that was crazy. He's so comfortable saying this every single night on his streams that it legitimately gets me concerned about any girl that gets remotely near him. He also has a private Discord server for any person that makes clips from portions of his kick streams and posts them to TikTok. Hey, by the way, Chad, if you do not know, I have this Discord where we chill off stream. It's called Out the Hood, okay? We put, um, so it's just like my mods and a whole bunch of clippers. It's where I literally, I end stream, I go in there and we just kick it. And we just do like, I'll do like Omi Discord streams are fucking crazy. We gamble a little bit. So if you want in the Discord, you, you know, just make a little TikTok page. Post some of my clips. Each video they get 75k views. I cash up be like 30 bucks. He hypes it up as a place where he can be more relaxed, where he doesn't have to worry about saying or doing the wrong thing on stream. If this is how he acts on Omegle on stream, it scares me to think how he acts on Omegle off stream. He even has a running gag that he and his chat do every single night and these are from one-off occasions where riot tells these girls that he's a streamer wait chat one in the chat if you're smashing two if you're passing well, someone said three. Oh, three? Oh my yeah. god it's really bad why chat. Three is <gasps> that so they like you a lot apparently there's a lot of threes in here what is three i need to know what three is don't worry about it oh my god chat it's just an inside joke don't worry about it three means um think of a word that rhymes with grape So not only are you encouraging this, you're having your chat to participate. Okay. <sighs> oh. So I think they like you. Like, they like you a lot. Stop saying three, chat. You want to know what three means? It's f crazy. I don't know how this inside joke started, bro, but what's, like, a word that rhymes with grape? Uh, so everyone uh, spamming three, I think, really likes you, you know? Like, really likes you. Oh, my God, dude. We got to Dude, that three trend is crazy, bruh. We literally started some bruh. I bet most streamers are so confused now. Because I am I swear to God, I've been opening chats, and I've been seeing threes when baddies come up, and it, the, the streamer doesn't even know what the f*** it means. They spam three for any girl that they think is capable. How is that in any way funny? So how big is Ben? He's already been. He's already been. He's kicked off the platform. He's gone. This shit is gone. Where is Kick in all of this? There is actual criminal activity happening on their platform and they're not doing anything about it. Riot is a verified account on their website, by the way. So I feel like Kick should be quick to notice this. Where is Kick staff members? to moderate their site and ban him instantly. Well, luckily there are Kick staff members, but Riot is friends with them. Bro, has Kick on his side. Oh God, I got Andre on my side. Hey, Andre, are you still in the chat? I have a question. All right, Andre, if I had Kick on stream, would I get banned? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Our goal is to keep everyone safe. I agree, man. Chat. Now read the first letter of every word. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I'm Wow. I'm kidding. Riot is so good with them that he's comfortable doing his brand of humor directly to their face in chat. No, I'm yeah. always on my best Ooh. behavior, Andre. Don't worry. Oh, oh, I remember you. Hey, Andre's in my chat. Can you shake his What? Andre said no. he's me. Shake some ass, bitch. Quote, word for word. He's me 15, dude. See, like I Yo, Andre, to... really? She's 15. Andre, she's 15. No. What the f***, Andre? Stop asking these girls to get... Kid. So these are Riot's true colors, and it's all done live every single night 
on Kick. Now, why wow. would Kick give their stamp of approval to people that think this is funny? Chad, these clothes are not loyal. Don't ever cuff a girl, okay? Oh my, what's your name? Hey, listen, you're really pretty, but can I talk to the one in the middle? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. All right, that's insane. <laughs> yeah. Now, I had to blur out who Riot was actually talking Live about. Live recorded felonies? Ex bro, they can't turn on their fucking brain for a second. About. Because it was a baby. In what the fuck? Oh my god, wow. Okay. What the fuck? Yo, what? Is... This shit not a good look, man. Hold on, bro. Let me see something. You know what's crazy, chat? Is there's literally a guideline against it. The person just wasn't the the kick staff that was in there just really wasn't following the fucking guideline. How are you kick staffing in there? There's I'm literally looking at it, chat. I'm literally looking at it. There's a guideline against it, bro. Hold on. Literally says, at Kick, we prioritize safety and well-being of our users, particularly children. To maintain a safe environment, we enforce the following rules. Age restriction. User must be at least 13 to use the platform or 16 if they uh, reside in uh, European, whatever, whatever. No streaming minors. Creators must not intentionally stream images or content featuring users under 18, including respecting the privacy and safety of minors in any content shared. Do not share images and conversations involving uh, users under 18. It's like the nigga seen that the rules were being broken and literally did nothing. Okay. Actual infant. This type of content, this creator, kick as a platform in general, has, in my opinion, gone on for long enough. It has shown itself time and time again to be a platform full of dangerous and harmful people. There are more creators like Riot out there, but that's a story for another day. But in the meantime, let's catch Riot because I have a few questions I would love to ask him. I tried to connect with him on the original Meagle and this happened. Really, dude. Wait, my webcam was displaying a video of a girl Riot previously connected with. Connect with him on the original Meagle, and this happened. Really, dude. No f***ing way, bro. Now that I got your attention, can I ask you a few questions, man? Yeah, sure. I know that girl, by the way. I saw her before, but yeah. Go ahead. Yeah, man, how, how are you doing? How's the kickstreams doing? Oh, what the f***? Yeah, how's the kickstreams doing? So before I can even get to my main question, he skipped me. So I guess that's it. But do you remember that girl from earlier? The girl who said that she was drugged at a party and Riot still got her to expose herself? Well, I managed to find her on Omegle minutes after her interaction with Riot. And I told her everything about him in his stream. She still seemed clearly out of it and uh, I couldn't help but feel so terrible for her. She was so easily manipulated. But she told me that if she were to connect with Riot again, that she would give him a piece of her mind. And I'm proud to say that she did that. Dude, why are you still on here? Okay, first of all, like, I'm not dumb. What do you mean? I'm not dumb. You know, I was watching your live. What? How'd you find my live? I found your live. Wait, you how know? though? Oh, you, Do you yeah, like yeah. it? Are the shoes fire or no? I just want to acknowledge how dumb of a question this is. You just got a girl to unknowingly expose herself in front of a live stream and then have her body put onto a Discord server. How do you think she's going to react? Are the shoes fire or no? Mid good shit. You f***ing are a psychopath. Oh, that for real? Yeah, and you shouldn't be doing that. Wait. I don't get it. Hmm, interesting. Now, this is the moment. This is the exact moment that I feel like should be studied by so many human psychologists. Because right now, Riot's brain cannot compute why this girl possibly wouldn't like his stream. He's also trying to figure out who could have possibly have told her that he's a streamer. And in the craziest display of luck 
in perfect timing as he's still in this state of confusion. Guess who connects with him again? My webcam was displaying a video. Okay. Yo, man. Like, you can't sit here, you can't think, like, put two and two together, like, oh, maybe, just maybe she's pissed off that you fucking recorded her without her consent and sold it to niggas. Nigga cannot compute. Like, <laughs> Suavemente. That was the guy? That was the same girl that you saw, bro. Skip there. And now, everything makes sense to him. He finally connected the dots. And because of that, he proceeds to close Omegle, listen to his Spotify playlist, and plays Fortnite. But during that entire time he's playing Fortnite, he's texting his people. Hey chat, what's that YouTuber's app? The guy that you guys kept saying, you know, I kept skipping him? What's his app? Something about chickens? No, it's not even that. It's just like, I'm not even being entertaining either right now. I'm just... He's scared. Nigga is frightened. You dumb fuck. The nigga's terrified. Terrified. He finna shit himself. That, that idea of news bugging me out, you know? And he ends the stream like this. I'm gonna go clear my head, bro. Like, this is actually bad. Um, and like, it's really, really bad, bro. I'm like, low-key scared. Oh, God. I love you guys, okay? Um, I love you. Yeah, it is. It, it literally is. Anybody under the age of 18 knew. It don't matter if it's your own. Somebody sent it to you. You now, like, if somebody, if you are underage and somebody your same age took a picture of themselves and sent it to you, you're now in possession of CP. It doesn't matter if you're over the age of 18 or not. If you, if you took a picture of yourself and sent it to somebody else and you still have that picture, you are in possession of CP. If you sent it, you distributing CP. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter the age. Love you guys. That's all I can say. I'm not gonna rate anyone. I'm just gonna go to bed. Peace out, chat. He proceeds to remove the NSFW channel from his Discord, wow. delete all of his previous stream VODs, and stayed radio wow. silent for a few days. All of this happened a while ago, because I was waiting to see if he would change his content in any way. And, uh... Yeah. YouTubers only do that to see your sub count to see your cook. Yeah, you he he was cook. Yeah, you're cook. Hey, Tyranny, thank you for the uh the gift, man. Appreciate it. No. N not at all. He still tries to seek out girls on Omegle and tries to get their snaps. He still asks these girls to pop one, but now he just doesn't have an NSFW channel to put it in. It's just for his eyes only. As if that makes it any better. All right, can I see your t I'm a hide screen, hold on. On God, on God, I hit it, on my life, look. See, I swear to God. His chat needs to frequently remind him to ask the girls their age before getting into inappropriate questions. It's bad when you never- <laughs> Hey, maybe like remind me? Like you guys never remind me to check the age. You have one job. I always look at chat. All You're you have to do- You're a grown ass man. You're a grown ass man. The only, now one, the only reason you changed your content is because you got caught. But for two, you're telling you're trying to put this on your chat. Like they're at fault here. The fuck the chat. If you you go out to a club and you you try to talk to a girl, your chat gonna be there to remind you to like lock the fuck in. You never do it, bro. But alas, here's him talking to a 17 year old, connecting with this girl on Omegle. Oh, sorry. I was <laughs> You look like the dude from Victorious. Sec? Oh, you could be my Jade. So how old are you? Hey, Tyranny, thank you for the gift this up again, bro. I'm 17. Gulp. Yeah. FBI, I swear I'm innocent. I didn't do shit, bro. Hold on. I'm Not looking something up. Um... But pronunciation from, like, Netflix. Having a wow. long and inappropriate conversation with her. Our babies would be cute. <laughs> I could allow just went there. Yeah, just jumped it. You know what I'm saying? Fuck a first date. How many bodies do you have? Another way you could get your...
is fatter is um i heard squats on my face did you have snap or just ig yeah i also got snap you know i was actually born with like a superpower for real what's your superpower okay i can guess any girl's bra size i don't want to make it like sexual but like go like this wait so okay. you're, you're you're a virgin too dude you have to come to america bro i'm not gonna lie i live in miami so you would love it all right you're yeah. a virgin but like hypothetically if you weren't what do you think would be your favorite position that's got to be like top You're so corny, bro. I'm glad he's gone. I am. I'm glad he's gone, but god damn, this is it, it's just not a good look, bro. Especially for a platform starting out and to also have one of one of the staff members was in there not even enforcing the guidelines. Uh no, man. I don't I don't want to be a part of like Come on, bro. Ten things up his. I'm a texter. You're on delivered. Actually, her texter my phone, pal. Even adding her on Discord, and this is a rare case where he told her about his streams, and she became a regular appearance. Did he get on banned? Yeah, he's banned. He's, he's his channel's gone. His streams for. The only thing I just I really hope. Kick is kick happens to be very fucking forgiving with people. Like, I need Kick to really lock the fuck in and keep this nigga gone, bro. This shit is, it's not, it's not even a joke. It's not like something that can, you know, you can come back from. It's, he's been doing it and it's, it's all like, bro, this is not a good look. For a while. Continuing to talk sexually. They talked all the time. What did you say? He's really attractive in guys to, so I can make up for it. Here you go. V-line. Is there, is there a trust? You'll see it on snap tonight. I promise. Right, I'm going to fly you out, show, bro. What? Where do you go? V line. Is there is there a trust? I feel like they never pr they, exactly, and that's the problem. Allowing this person to be unbanned, especially for something like this, is insane. Proceeds to show this seventy year old his. Uh, You'll see it on Snap tonight. I promise. I'm gonna fly you out, bro. On God, I'm flying you out. Cause uh. Kick needs to do something about the guidelines, bro. It's the thing. I just showed you the guidelines. It's in there. Hold on. Let me see if they have like a. Just heard that the main scumbag in the video is permabanned and a staff member who encouraged it has been let go from kick. That's what other kick streamers are tweeting. So maybe, hopefully, you know what I'm saying, hopefully there's there's light at the end of this dark tunnel, but you know what I'm saying? It's now now all now what it is is damage control. You need to do some more vetting. Now I will say this, you know what I'm saying? Twitch not having it. Cap. Cap. Cause there's there's predators on Twitch too. Let's let's not let's not try to bash kick me and big up Twitch. Twitch got the same predators. You know what I'm saying? They just can't do it on the platform because it's you know what I'm saying? But they gotta kick gotta do damage control. But I will say I wouldn't say I will say in a sense of betting a little bit Twitch ban shit like this for a reason twitch ban shit like this for a reason but i just i need kick to stand on what they you know what I'm saying no i mean like doing the omega oh yeah twitch not having the omega stream also though like we can't like they just need to do more vetting some people are in some terrible places and places of power and it's disgusting isn't like pokemon supposed to do a whole expose on a twitch staff that was being weird with her and shit like that so it's like it's not like it's just a platform i just i don't know i, I think it's just weird i don't i just don't get it i can't fathom what the fuck makes you think Shit like this is okay. That's just where I'm at right now. I'm not gonna lie. The shit you were uh, saying last night was uh, very, very convincing. What are the odds you would actually let me fly you out? When I'm 18. He knows I'm 17. Why do they know? Why do they know what? No, they say you saw my 17 year old kid, which is not true. Oh, yeah, no. I'm trolling, by the way. I'm just kidding. Deleted three chats? What did you delete? Oh, the... Oh, no. Oh, those. Wait, chat. I'm not. Hopefully, this is still in our saved. It was something you said. Hold on. You don't care if I show like it's just words. It doesn't really matter. Don't stop it. Don't be right in the fucking chat. I'm not gonna say what I sent, but uh, yep. can I fly yeah. you out? You know why you can't right now, but it's not legal to say your chest.
Yo. She didn't mean it like that, Chad. She's. Why'd you just say that, bro? They're gonna be on my. They're always on your dick. Can you be on my dick? And if anyone raised wow. any concern about the age, here's his response. Chat, listen, bro. I don't give a f bro. Listen, I'm not promoting anything weird. I'm just saying this, okay? F you if you think it's weird. You're just a fucking American like hick. Like on God, you guys are retarded. <laughs> he just doesn't care. Chat, bro, she's gone. I'm just gonna fucking... Dude, one day, bro, I'm gonna fly her out. You're just fucking... Oh my God. And there's even more examples. <gasps> Hello. Hi, I did. I'm good. Wow. Like, I, I like you uh, a lot. How old are you? Please be 18 or above. I'm praying. I hate to disappoint, but I'm 17. Wait, I'm 20. How old did you say you were? I'm 17. What? Your mic is lagging. How old are you? Uh, no, I'm, I'm 18. Oh, it worked. You're 18? Yeah. Yeah, no. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Cool. Uh, so... <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Minor, uh, I'm getting to your size, for real. Oh, yeah, yeah. Can I try and guess your size? Okay, go like this. So, can I give you my Snapchat? All right, listen. This is going to be good, okay? You know, high five. I grabbed your t Oh, my God. All right, all right. You know, I love you, okay? Doodles. Silva, was that crazy? She's 18. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't crazy at all. That's what I'm saying. I don't know what you guys are yapping about, to be honest. See, everything about Riot completely baffles me because he knows what he's doing he does and that's the fuck like i can't really like i can't fathom how you know what you're doing is illegal it is a felony they can look up the age of he consent. knows what he, he looked up the age of consent in her state right age of consent is 15 still weird by the way now you fly her out She's in Florida. She's in Miami. The age of consent is 18. Now it's a fe like, look the like, use your fucking brain. What the fuck? Oh my god! You know what? He's done. He manipulates these girls to unknowingly do whatever he wants on his streams, and my brain can't wrap around why he would do this. And then I reminded myself, all the evidence is in your va. You told me why you do this. You told everyone. In a stream you did with Zerka, who is the most controversial person to work with, but later in that exact same stream, Zerka added Nick Fuentes. Yes, that Nick Fuentes. But I'm getting sidetracked. In that stream, Zerka asked Riot and his girlfriend, yes, Riot does have a girlfriend. Bro, what about like your IRL girlfriend? Max like I'm actually being 100. No, that's the go. The reason I don't like actually like f around with girls or anything is because like. So not only, not only do you actually have a girlfriend. Not only do you actually have a girlfriend. And you do this type of content. I'm sorry, that's just so disrespectful. Like, there's a difference between content and, like, really, like, you don't give a, like, that shit is insane. But why the fuck? It's, it's like dumb and dumber. It's like you have, you do this stupid shit with a girlfriend and she's still with you while you do this stupid shit. She's got to be dumb, too. Monkey see, monkey fucking do. Dumb and dumber, bro. Because not only are you disrespecting her in her face, there's multiple occasions where you do it with underage people. And she's la 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 la, bozo brain, bozo brain. Jesus fucking Christ. They're actually autistic. Especially the girls that live in my city. Bro, they're all copy and paste. But Maxie, bro, I don't, know how, I don't know how to explain it. Like, Maxie's like, bro, she's so funny on God. Maxie, you know how much I like you, right? I fucking like, uh, you know, I like you a lot, okay? Let me reassure that. A lot, a lot, a lot. It's so weird. We're like, it's like, like, it's just perfect. No, right? yeah. Okay? We, we do connect really good. The only fucking girl I like on this whole entire Snapchat. But in that stream with Zerka, he asked them this. So, uh, what's your name? Matsim. You can call me Mats or Matsy. You're not a fuck, but you let him flirt with other girls? Yeah. You, 
It's content. Do you let him? Do you let him take other girls? I mean, it's only for business, though. La la la, bozo brain, bozo brain. La la la, for content. Ah la 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 la. It's not nothing fucking, there's no, no cogs turning in that motherfucker. No cogs turning. Even, like, the thing is, even if it was just women of age, it wouldn't be nearly as bad. Like, if he was, if he was flirting, now, excluding the recording them, you know what I'm saying? But he was flirting, getting their Snapchats, excluding recording. There's niggas that date porn stars. There's niggas that date only after OF people. So I I don't totally exclude that. But when you know he's just he was distributing that shit at one point, and when you know he's also done this to under LS, it's like, all right. There's a difference between content and fucking wrong. Turn it the fuck on. Turn it on. Nobody, I, like, I just can't see, I can't fathom how many people don't actually use the fucking brain that's in their head, bro. So there's your answer. It's only for business. To them, it's just content. Getting all these girls to do all this stuff for you is just for the business of it. For Riot's content. But does it make it right? Not even in the slightest. So you're telling me when Riot goes on Snapchat of all the girls that he's met on Omegle and shows every single photo to his stream and oops, he may accidentally show a nude? You're telling me that's a part of Riot's business? Riot's showing his friends on Discord photos of the girls he's gotten to do stuff with. So you want to see, uh, oh, I got you. This girl's body is ridiculous, bro. Can you see yeah. my phone right now? Yeah. Okay. God damn. Yo. <laughs> Chad, I'm an East Demon. Life's getting crazy. Yo. <laughs> These girls who some don't know were on your streams. But to you, their bodies is your content. And you and your girl know what you're doing. I, you guys just know what you're doing. And the only reason why I'm bringing Riot's girl into this is because remember that clip of the 15 year old? Guess who was in a Discord call with him during all of that? There's no fucking way. There's no, oh my God, oh my God. Oh my fucking God. Yeah. Cool. Alright. Chad, that's fucking, that's that's the shit I do for you guys, bro. And you say it like so like <laughs> I don't know. I mean, how is there a nice way to say can I see your please explain no, it to me because if there is, no, I would love to know. It. So you just heard him coerce her to say and encourage her to say she was 18. You just heard him. You heard him. You were probably tuned in to the fucking stream. She's probably a mod in that bitch. Dumb and fucking dumber, bro. Bro, what do you mean fumbled? The chat, did you want me, yes or no? How did I fumble? He like, wanted you. The thing is, bro, that was Loki fucked up. Just telling you. I know He's it. So I <laughs> She's coaching a nigga. It's low-key fucked up. She's a minor. <laughs> okay. She's just maxi Joe. Yeah. Chat, when she stood up, on God, I didn't even look. And when she was going to flash, on my life, I wasn't even going to look. That's she was like, doing it for you guys. That's weird. Like, my, I swear on everything I love, I'm doing this for you guys. Even though she's 18, there's nothing wrong with that. Yeah. Right yeah. Uh -huh. so. But somehow it's just for the business of doing this kick content, right? Hey, so this part is being added in because everything that I'm about to tell you happened just a few days ago as of the time of this video going live. Now this next part needs a little bit of context, so bear with me here. So Bryant has another content creator friend named Citrus. He connected with this girl on Omegle and got her to expose herself. But she didn't know that she was on his live stream. A clip of her ended up 
on Twitter. And Citrus's audience found any information they could gather to spread this video to people close to this girl. So corny, so fucking corny. And it affected her. All I'm gonna say is that because of Citrus and Citrus's fans having that video get uploaded to Twitter of her exposing herself, it took a toll on her. She's already in a vulnerable state. So what I'm about to show you is Citrus and Riot fully manipulating that for content. So let's cut to a few months later. After the whole Citrus situation, Riot connected with this girl on Omegle and got her to flash. And then... You're on Discord, aren't you? No. I, I swear to God, I'm not. And you keep looking that way. No, yeah, I have another monitor. Wait a minute, wait a minute. My thing is... I hope this is not the same girl. Because... It, it, wait, wait. I, I need him to re-explain what it is. For content. So let's cut to a few months later. After the whole Citrus situation, Riot connected with this girl on Omegle and got her to flash. And then... Okay, wait the... Alright. I'm sorry, she needs to fucking turn it on too. If you got... If you were on Omegle, you flashed, the shit went viral on Twitter and it's fucking your life up. Why the fuck would you connect with somebody else and flash your shit again? Oh my, is everybody fucking dumb? Am I bugging? And uh, I, I, maybe I need to I need to see the rest of this clip because that is that is insane. Because it's not it's not like he was saying before. He said a few months after. No, I I swear to God I'm not. And you keep looking that way. No, yeah, I have another monitor. I'm I'm watching uh, YouTube. All right, bro. I can't, bro. I, it hurts lying, bro. I'm a streamer, but I swear to God I hit it when you showed your t all my life. I swear to God. Do you know who yeah. Citrus is? Because he's in my chat right now saying he knows you. Yeah. Wait, what's your freaking expose me? Shit, Rish. <laughs> so you've been ex okay. You're a dick. Cool. We already established this nigga's a problem. But like, turn your fucking brain on, Shorty. You were literally exposed before, all placed all over the internet. These niggas damn near dox your shit, and you do it again. Why are you just on? Okay, whatever. All right, whatever. Oh my fucking god, I'm getting hot. That's how pissed. He didn't tell me that uh, he was streaming, and apparently, he, <laughs> viewers were posting me on Twitter and to my family. Oh, sh they found your family. Mm-hmm. Is this a bad time to ask this here? Again. He then proceeded to get her in a group Discord call with Citrus so that he can apologize for the Twitter incident. But must we forget, they're kick streamers. So we know the real reason why they got her in that group chat. I just want to say, like, <laughs> when I first saw, like, your I didn't expect it and shit, <laughs> like, to be that amazing. And my chat was in love the same as I was. And I just kept hyping it up even though I shouldn't, you know? I should have told you I was live. That was up of me. Not fun when all your viewers were just threatening me and they also brought in my dad. Yo, you guys are deep in not nah, AR loyals That's are fucked. I think he's apologizing for his chat. Yeah, I, I am apologizing for my chat. And and me myself, I did a mistake too. You know? Holy shit, I'm fucking dying. So do you accept my apology? It might just take me some time because it was really hard. But for them this is just content, so they're gonna milk it for all it's worth. I, I'm sure nothing like that will ever happen again. Right, Citrus? Yeah, I know, but I have a question. You know, when we met, I wasn't going to the gym, but do you think, like, anything changed? I mean, look at laughing. Like, I won't stick my between those big ass Oh, my fault, my fault, my fault. I will fly you out if you are down to do an IRL stream with me in person. I will fly you out to Miami. Accept the flight. Except, say yes, I am down to come to Miami. Oh, I have a good idea. Would you want to play strip Fortnite? Every kill I get, you remove one clothing. Why don't you make an no OF? Offense. You would make so much money. Let me put you on. I will make you rich. All my life, I will. Let's you would make it bad. It. 
You would Let's make a bag. Let's talk about it. I will manage your OS. You know, I'm, you would be making at least twenty thousand dollars a month off of me. Are you wearing like what are you wearing right now? Can we see the outfit. Can I see him again? Uh, sorry, I just have like short-term memory loss. I'll hide the screen right now if you show us. This is a lie. Citrus only fully covered two of the seven times they pushed her to do suggestive stuff on stream, and Riot only fully covered four of the seven times. And Citrus's audience were clipping and saving portions of the entire stream. I'll hide my too. Hold on one second. Black screen right now we'll let them out and after she does citrus adds his friends to the call Hello? yo so, so, hey I don't, hey no questions asked show them show them to my boy hold on let, let it rip. rip let it rip she has a later show us yeah can we see her yeah, 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 let's see it. we just want to see it. No, how we learn is like visual instruction can i see her arch and when this girl found out that these streamers were not covering the screen when she was exposing herself again, therefore causing Citrus's fans to be clipping portions from this stream to post online all over again. She talked about unaliving herself, and this is how they react to that. You never turn the camera off, did you? No, I did. On, on God, I did. Oh, GG's. Uh, GG's. Who the f snitched? Because I'd never Weird. Kid, yeah, bro. I just don't want to go see that again. No, I understand. You just don't have to. Just don't give them Yo. the attention. Like that's all they want. Yeah, it's just. <sighs> yeah, that bitch is gonna fucking kill herself. Okay, can I see you smile, please, for me? A smile, just a quick smile. Should I tip her, bro? Is that? Just be like, yo, wait, can I just send you money and you just forget about it? Wait, type in one if you guys think she'll actually do it. Put a two if she won't. I don't think we should test the limits, of course, but like... Look at me. You hear me? No, drop your phone now. Stop going through these messages because that's what's ruining your mood. That's not what's ruining her mood. She wouldn't be getting these messages. All right. She was being forced to... Do this and manipulated, don't be mad at her. Manipulated, yes. Forced, no. Like, think about it for a second. Somebody that previously exposed you is telling you to expose yourself again. I'm sorry, you're not being forced. Leave the fucking call. I, 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 you, like, uh, there's, there's gotta be, a, there's, I need accountability across the fucking board. Across the board. I mean, she's being constantly attacked and given death threats. No. Jay, listen to me. That happened months prior. She showed, it got leaked, she was receiving death threats. Right? You proceed to expose yourself again and do the same shit. Why would you do it again? And then you proceeded to get in a call with them. Like there's, there's, there was, there was nothing. It was just like, you got in a call with the same nigga. And it wasn't like she was receiving death threats at the time she did the second flash. Even if she was, it wasn't nearly, it was a couple months after. Nobody's that dedicated, maybe one or two people, but no one's that dedicated to continuously send you death threats and, and notify. I don't, she said, I don't want to go through that again. She wasn't 15. He didn't say this one was underage. The other one was underage. When his girlfriend was in the call. Y'all gotta keep up with the timelines. I gotta keep up with the timelines. She has done this on different people's streams. I'm not mad at her, but... Uh, I'm not mad at her, but turn the phone off. Yeah. You'd be surprised how many niggas get... Niggas is that boresome. But like, I... Yo... I need every, like, terrible. Other dude, terrible. The girl, I'm not even saying you're a terrible person. Just turn your fucking brain on for a second. That's where I'm at. You're probably not a bad person. But just understand, you want to, the person tells you they're live streaming. You it's you you're putting yourself in the same predicament again. That's that's literally psych that's what is it? Uh being a, psych, a psychotic person doing the same shit over and expecting a different result. If you did something one way and it did not work out for you and it did 
Why would you do it again? Jizz. She w it don't matter if it's a new streamer or not. It's insanity. Thank you. Why would you do it again? And not only did you do it again with one streamer, you also went in the call and did it again. Everybody needs to be held accountable, bro. Everybody. Yes, yeah, she's a victim, but she's also like, I'm not, it's not even victim blaming at the point. The other, the other instance, for sure, you can blame him because you did not know. But to go and do the same thing again is insane. Right, that's just bad decision making at that point. That's bad decision making. Wouldn't be getting these threats. None of this would have happened if it wasn't for Citrus and Riot and yes, other kick streamers who fully manipulated her without her knowing that she was on a live stream. Mentally, you need to jump over those obstacles and be the... This time she knew. I ain't gonna lie, this time she knew. Because li he literally said he's live streaming. Riot said he was live streaming. Best. You are the best. You can't let no one stop you. You are the f***ing queen. Do you hear me? And people love you. People care about you. Yo. You have your own book. And there's going to be a happy ending at the end. I know oh. it. Yeah, we're... Don't say that. Yo. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. This was a crazy roller coaster, bro. No way you guys are putting bets on if she... Okay. <laughs> Yo, this is... This is like... Side watch, not an e-day. Everyone has a reason to be alive. Everyone has a purpose on this earth. So you have a purpose on this earth. We are going to make it out and we're going to be the best. All right. Say that. We're going to be the best. Say the best. What's your dream? I actually want to know. What's your dream? He might be cooking. What do you want to do like in life? I just want to be a mom. Hmm. You want to be a mom already? You want to be a mom. What if I make you a mom? My chat says get her pregnant. They physically cannot turn off the content side of their brain. They always feel the need to entertain and feed into the chat. You want to be a mom? No, I got you. I got you right here. You want to be a mom, right? You have a lot to live for. You got a lot of good traits and everything, you know, don't don't make a rational decision. You, you know, you're definitely going to regret or irrational, well, sorry. Then you shouldn't have made me show off my face. And I fucked up. What you're thinking is definitely not the answer. You know, don't be scared to like reach out and here, I'll DM you my number right now. Should never be in that state of mind. Um, okay. Risk. You're still very young. Long life ahead of you. You know, don't don't think like that. You know. Wait, what does that say? He ignores everything that she says for the next thirty seconds. Terrible fucking people, man. She's obviously not mentally there. The issue is them taking advantage. She's using this as validation. Yeah, niggas is not all the way there, bro. Oh. Sorry, you, you just lagged. What'd you say? When she's talking about the problems that she's going through in her life, her story, Riot says this. What happened? Stop yapping, bro. When you drive someone to consider death as an option, I think it's time to reevaluate the content that you're making. And I highly think Kick should reevaluate the creators that they're platforming. Because if they don't, something devastating could happen. What they were doing is so awful that I couldn't just stand by and just let that happen. So I reached out to her while this was all happening. And then she added me to the call. Now, I by no means am a skilled debater and I really don't think I did too well, to be honest. However, it didn't stop these streamers from showing their true colors. Hey. Hey. Who's this? I just have a question for you guys. What? Who's this? I'm scared. Whatever's happening right now is beyond messed up uh -huh. on so many levels. Did I not? have a fool on straight on serious combo with her did you did you not see that part my chat was saying oh have her do it have her do it if i was egging it on by the chat i would say oh do it do it just to get the last but guess what i talked to her i fucking spoke deep with her no the fuck you didn't no you didn't no the fuck you didn't
you still managed to try to turn that shit into content, nigga. What do you want to be in life, Amon? Oh, I can make you a mom. Like, Everyone has a reason to be alive. Everyone has a purpose on this earth. You want to be a mom? What if I make you a mom? My chat says, get her pregnant. You talked about managing her fans. Okay, I'm a businessman and she was down. Let me manage her. What's wrong with that? Trust me, I'm not getting Bro. Leave. Everyone yeah. go spam, leave. You were fixated on bringing her out to Miami. Guess what? I'm not actually bringing her out to Miami. She got, she gets happy. Then why did you say all that? Oh my God. So why what? did you say all If that? I was being serious, I'm weird. If I was lying, I'm weird. So yes, nigga. Like, like, there's shit to be serious about. Like, bro, in it, you're, you're lying. The reason you lied was for content, nigga. Everything, even even if when you were being serious, even if you were lying, it was for content at the end of the day. No matter if it's a truth or it's a lie. If you're doing something out of content when she's telling you how she's feeling, it's still losing behavior, bro. So what do you want, kid? What makes you happy? Look at you. Miles Morales, you are making a fool of yourself. Thanks for the roses. Thank you. Thanks for the roses. Oh, I can't use that right now. Thanks for the roses. <laughs> oh, ice cream so good. Thanks for the roses. I get that you're a content creator and your job is to entertain. But in a situation right now, I really don't think you should be entertaining people. Bro. You're the one who I'm going to be the good person here. Him. You know what? Let me get the W's. I want to get the views, not him. I'm pointing out a problem here with kick content. Thanks for the roses. What's the problem? Thanks for Wait, the roses. Wait, what happened? Thanks for the roses. You want? Hey, you want a box, bro? You you want to make money off this? Let's let's talk money. Well, now we talking money now. You you know what? This is gonna go viral. Let's box. Let's make it more viral. Let's. Chat. You want to know something? I was. I think I was talking to Phil about this the other day. You can tell the niggas that were fucking losers in high school and proceeded to end up being content creators and got money. Because they're still fucking losers. You can literally, you can tell. You can tell. It's it's all over his, like, the nigga was picked on, he was probably bullied. You were a fucking loser. You can tell. It's, it's like, it's in your mannerisms. It's in the way you talk. It's in the way you carry yourself that you were a loser. And you just ended up getting money. That's it. Literally. Look at, like, watch this shit without audio. Watch the last five seconds without audio. Look, look, look. This right here. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, that loser you can tell <laughs> you can tell you can tell I, I like I don't need to hear anything else from this nigga never nigga never got bitches in high school never even probably talked to bitches in high school ever nigga doesn't even know how to talk to people let alone bitches but he gets money all, all of a sudden gets his confidence but you're still a loser viral Let's box. Let's make it more viral. Let's make money. So no, because that's a low. In my in my opinion, that's a low in content. No, it's not. It's it's just to get money. Like, do you not like money, bro? You saw the part where I was serious talking about her. Wasn't looking at chat. Wasn't saying anything. Wasn't laughing. How you were talking about how you take her out on a date and fly her out to Miami multiple times, yeah. Bro, you were watching the sure. end of it. When she was smiling and stuff and saying she was down. <sighs> of course. Right, of course he left. <laughs> nice. He left. Nope. No. No. Why'd you remove him? Like, why'd, you, why'd you kick him? Yeah, what? Hey, dude, you're fried if you think saying that call was a good idea. I don't give a f bro. Also, just minutes after this stream, he paid a Twitter account to post a very positive and totally not fake story about him paying for four people's college debt. Even if this story is real, charity is a good thing in general, but not when it's used as good PR to distract from you making a girl want to unalive herself. But let's check out it. Riot's stream the next night. After everything that took place, Riot celebrated that stream. Put a one in the chat if you were here for last night's stream, let me know. Oh my God, last night's stream was crazy. I ain't gonna lie. Buddy, that was crazy. Yeah, last night's stream was 
fucking crazy. Uh, shout out to the boy Citrus. Uh, we 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 set up a fucking content factory last night. That, was, that was crazy. <laughs> oh, I'm about to get locked up. Oh. Nah, kidding, kidding, kidding. You see what I mean? He called the entire situation with that girl a content factory. And then hours later, during that exact same stream, he gets a donation by one of the founders of Kick. Everyone keeps mentioning Riot Law. Yeah, yeah I get Riot Law. Right. What is this? Okay. <laughs> now, that's fucked. It looks bad, bro. It looks very bad. But you also gotta think, bro. It looks bad. It is is he's he's clueless. He's clueless, bro. It looks bad, but he's clueless. Nigga said everybody says everybody in the chat keeps saying right. He goes to his team, he's on the slots. I'm one to say Eddie Eddie don't even stay. Eddie will come in, in here and gift and is gone in a, in a flash. Nigga doesn't stay. Probably didn't know. I'm willing to give him the benefit of the doubt. Because if he's saying niggas is like, y'all keep saying, you know what I'm saying? It, it looks very fucking bad, though. It looks very bad. He's mentioning Riot Law. Yeah. Riot Law. What is this? He trolls. So you can swear Eddie's here. Yo! Yo! Holy f Oh my god, Eddie, bro! Eddie, bro! Holy sh No f***ing way! Alright, big shout out to the right That's awesome, that's awesome. It's so funny. No, no, not sure if I quite love you, man, but I f***ing love the enthusiasm. It's legend. I wonder how he would feel about donating to Riot if he knew the situation that that's happened just a- Right, the timing is insane, bro. I don't blame Kick, I blame the streamers. Yeah, there's, you gotta also think, though, there's niggas that's gonna exploit rules like a motherfucker. Now, that nigga, that kick staff that was in there and needed, I'm glad he was held accountable, because he needed to be. You saw that shit going down, bro. It did nothing. Day before. But if we've learned anything from the Ice Poseidon situation that happened a few months ago on kick, something tells me he wouldn't care. And that's the problem Damn. with kick. Do you understand? Yeah, that Ice Poseidon shit was bad, too. And how illegal this is so i don't know how to but i think i think it was proven that that ice poseidon shit was a, uh it was some type of uh i don't don't quote me but i feel like i seen a tweet where ice poseidon was trying to uh where he explained it and like apparently the clip was taken out of context and if you like watch the rest of the vod apparently she knew or something like that I don't know. I can't. I can't. Don't quote me though. But I. I think he. Tr he got online and tried to explain it. If somebody can find me the tweet, that'd be best. But that ice beside the shit was bad too. That kick is allowing this. He's a verified account. How is this content eighteen plus when the people Riot are talking to aren't even eighteen plus? Wow. So this is his content. I'm shirtless. Your shirt is on. This is a really tough situation. You know. I could have got that to do everything chat like everything bro this is his humor like to make a joke about like someone beating women like you know, that's, all, that's weird Stop being soft bro it's a f joke this is his personality how many tattoos do you have four what's your favorite one my room can i see it okay why'd you get it it symbolizes the survivors assault. yeah wait what it's did she say it was for Hey, why'd you get it? It symbolizes the survivors of assault. Yeah. It's okay, you can laugh. That's how I go. You know, I usually just come with like masturbating, but like I mean like one's slightly above the other. Wait, you kinda alright. Wait, you Jim? Bro, me and you should get some cardio in. How many bodies do you have? I'm just out of curiosity. I didn't mean to say that. Your teeth look really nice. I'm sorry, dude. Yo. Oh my god. Hey, crazy. Bro, that girl just told you she was a sexual assault survivor, and your next question was how many bodies do you have? Wait, was it? Oh god. Wait, your mic was lagging. Repeat that. That's literally what you- And he's got- You're so fu- You're- Oh my god. Yeah. 
You're a terrible person. All of his friends and even Kick backing him up. So Riot, this is my question to you. Do any of the girls that you've met on Omegle and ended up adding on Snapchat, do any of them know? Do any of them know about your streams? Do any of them from the NSFW channel know? I think I know the answer, and I know you do too. Shame on you. Shame on Kick. Shame on any one of his friends that knew about you and your content. And still let it slide. But will anything happen? The sad part is, probably not. Because to all these shameful kick creators, well... It's only for business, though. Content. Damn. That was a really well put together video. Glad the niggas banned. Glad, glad the kick staff is fucking out of here. Some people are just the fucking scum of the earth, man. They really are.